ancestry and say, are you related to Charles Harvey? Because Charles Harvey had a bunch of kids mm -hmm. all over the place, or somebody calling himself Charles Harvey, because when you are stepping out, you might use your cousin's name or whatever. And they said, oh, yeah, we have several Charles Harvey. They said, well, the age is wrong. I said, He's well, like, well, that's not well, one of these. That name? may be one of the brothers or something you know who? who was not telling the truth. So, yeah. And I'm looking at the people, I'm like, oh, you look like family. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and you're from the area. Yeah, you and you know there. the name. <laughs> so, it's, it's, you know, somebody was using that name. <laughs> but I've had several people talk And that's why I won't show. do it. <laughs> Because what? <laughs> Are you serious? Not do the DNA. <laughs> what? You don't want to find out you know, who's okay. been lying. I family is messy. And one of the main reasons is because I know they sell that data. Oh. They sell the data to the Department of Justice. They sell the data oh, to the FBI. They sell the data. Oh, yeah. And what they it's do, how they do it, is that. they'll take that data and they'll look at it and say, well, and they say, and they'll look at that database, and they'll say, oh, well, she has the same genetic markers as this DNA that was found at this crime scene. Oh, oh yeah. 20 years ago. <laughs> and so then they'll contact you saying, this person has yeah, this, same, this marker and that marker. <laughs> you know you've been playing. I ain't doing that. And they'll contact you and say, you have the same genetic marker as this this DNA that was found at this site. Mm. And they said, so it's a distant cousin, and do you know anything about, and then they'll look up in records. They'll try to find your relative.